Hold up. Hello and welcome back guys to a new episode of Casual Mobile Gaming. Thanks for tuning in and I'm getting quicker and quicker with that intro. I think there's almost like video number 400, uh, over a thousand subscribers. We are growing guys. Yeah, and it is Need for Speed time. We have a new fast lane event where we can win a La Ferrari again. We can win blueprints, obviously. Not the whole thing, but we already won blueprints with Onis and Silvia last time. And classic sports advantage pack. We got an RX7. Yeah, for nine euro ninety nine. No, I'm not going to do that. Yeah, I told you guys that I actually will finish the last one. I mean, yesterday I wasn't able to finish it because of s stupidly always hit the wall. And um, but this time I was good. And I finished, of course. I finished it, and we are on it. We are on track to get the newest one. To get another bunch of uh, Mitsubishi Lancer Evo 6. I think 6? Evo 6 uh, blueprints. Yeah, and let's just... Enough talking. More driving, my friends. Enough talking. Yeah, it's the Evo 6. It's a race medium, though. Yeah, yeah. I told you guys that it's very, very important that when you finish a chapter that you keep using your tickets. You should use your tickets every day. And, yeah, just having a good time there. I must say the um, the races where you're actually trying to beat the others <laughs> is usually one of the easiest races. Yeah, when you have like competition going on, rather than time trial or where you have clock running against you, these ones are way more difficult. Oh, track. I don't know if I ever described it in this one, but these ones are way more difficult. Yeah. So we're doing good here. No, it's not a good track. I remember that. I don't, or not, or, hmm? I don't know, I don't know. Oh, oh no! Man, stupid. Well, it's still going fine. That was easy. What was it? That was pretty, pretty easy. And we got another piece. I think with that one, we actually complete the next upgrade part. And man, they're pushing a lot of the mobile game currently. Yeah, they have FIFA Mobile. I Honestly, not a fan of it. I play FIFA on my PS4. I'm happy with that. But I was never happy about playing it on a mobile device. For a reason that, first of all, I need my controller. And second is that you know that um, it is for free. That means it is not the full game. It's not like really the full FIFA experience. That's what I would expect. And that's why I'm kind of like not interested in even trying something like this, like FIFA. There were a couple mobile football games which I actually tried on my channel and which were pretty cool and which were fun but it's not really like trying to replicate the whole feeling of FIFA. Yeah. I don't know if you understand what I mean. If you don't play FIFA you have no idea what I'm talking about right now. <laughs> but if you do, I think you can. Okay, so we got another airborne half level here. Okay. Oh man, this guy is... No, it's a catching up level. These ones are like medium difficulty I would say. Oh man, look at that drift though. Woo! Pretty good there. Man, this guy's fast. Oh, come on. Why am I always hitting the wall? Lately? I'm coming for you, my friend. I'm coming for you. I'm drifting. I'm coming. There was an I7 or what? I don't know, but he crashed a couple times as well. You saw his. Whoa, nice jump. And we brought it home. Another piece. Oh, come on. The windshield is broken because I hit the wall once? I mean, I slightly touched it. Sometimes it's weird. Sometimes you hit the wall like like a brick. So strong. And nothing happens. No scratch on your car. Sometimes you slightly touch it. And your car looks like, I don't know, you went to a destruction challenge or something. Okay. By the way, guys, you, um, as always, a uh, little bit about my channel. And there is... Oh, oh yes, yes. I think we got some... What we got here? Full burn. Sweet. 10k. Why not? Um, by the way, there's still the contest going on. If you don't know what I'm talking about, there is a contest for which I launched for the 
1000 subscribers special of course i need to do that need to give something back you can win some itunes or google play gift cards yeah what do you want to do with that all up to you you can buy games you can buy gold you can i mean in-game goals obviously right not like real that would be cool though um you can buy books if you read <laughs> i don't know if you read i like to read and um, you can buy books you can buy movies you whatever whatever you feel or oh, music music on itunes obviously so if you feel like doing that it is pretty easy all you need to do well is to watch my video on that video. Oh, come on stop it I don't know what I should say. It is uh, ah, come on, seriously. What we got? We got, we got three seconds left. Oh man, I feel like drunken driving here. Yeah. Drunken driving. That wasn't good. That wasn't good. But whatever. We got, we got our piece. Getting closer. Always. Yeah. I don't know. I I told that story many times. But just for people who maybe watch this video for the first time. Um, you always see when you go back here. You see that the Fast Dance Store is currently offering something. What could help you. You know what could actually bring you to. Uh, could upgrade you. For example this prototype input chef for 4000 credits. Now you would say hey why not buying that. I got 4000 credits. But before you're doing that. Prototype input chef. Yeah? You should check the next races. So here you can win a prototype flywheel. And here. Huh, there you go you see here you can win this one the prototype input chef so you anyways need to finish that race and then you get it for free so why you should buy it you know but of course when you need a double sometimes you need it twice three times whatever then do it but um, always keep yeah just an eye on it because they're trying to trick you they're trying to bait you that you're just spending money just trying to help you Okay, nail those jumps, nail those jumps. I will, I will, my friend. Man, let's go. Oh, get out of my way. This is my turn. Drafting time. And there we go. Nice drift. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Again, this monster. Oh, man, he is fast. He doesn't want to get rid of Okay, there we go. And another jump. By the way, you guys loved my video yesterday about... Oh, come on. You're not seriously faster than me. By the way, yeah. What I want to say. You guys loved my video yesterday about the MMX Hill Climb Part 2. MMX Hill Climb 2. It is not. Too. Yeah, I think you got that when you watched the video, of course. But it is like from the makers of Hutch Games, and it is like a branded, rebranded MMX Hitler racing. Yeah, just with Hot Wheels and so on. It's pretty cool, and then I did play it yesterday evening all the time. I really, really enjoy that, and trust me, it will turn into a series because I do enjoy that game. It's, I must say, it's way quicker than the usual hill climb. So I don't know, maybe it's because of, oh, 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 we got a garage, always, always upgrade. I know it's because Hot Wheels is now part of it or something like this, but it is way quicker and I do enjoy that game. It's pretty much fun. Besides that, uh, what other games? I, I do have so many games here. I got a new monster truck game, which I want, which I tried already once and it was fun to play so i want to show it to you guys so you can enjoy it a little bit as well again that arc seven man it's a bit more like this one that's the catching up one oh man let's see i probably won't oh i remember that level i remember that one how many times i was hitting the stupid wall yes that wall oh man i almost hit it again oh look at that drift monster Oh man, look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that drift, look at that drag. Oh, we did it. Oh, sweet. 1,152 meters, I think that was the longest drift ever recorded for me on Need for Speed No Limit. And I think we needed that because otherwise this guy would have kicked our ass. Oh yes, that was beautiful, that was a beautiful finish. 
There we go. And there we got the prototype input shaft, which we will use now. But as I told before, we need to check how many times we actually need it. We don't have any tickets left, but I will definitely finish that one. Yeah, we need two of that. But before we are buying that, all I would do is just I would wait until I get my five tickets. I would do the last two races and I would just redo because you're allowed to replay event number five and you're allowed to replay num number three where you will get an input shaft as well. So rather than buying it, I would just redo that. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's episode, guys. Um, lots of things are coming this week the upcoming week need to prepare a couple of videos for the weekend so you don't get bored or something like this and as always if you have any questions comments suggestions whatever leave it down below in the comment section and see you next time guys that was a casual mobile gamer i'm out